Hey guys, it's iMaster, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install a mod on your PHP BB4. Now, this is not exactly an easy tutorial, so I suggest um, you take it slow, but it seems overwhelming at first, but once you get it, it's it goes by. Excuse me if I'm moving fast, guys. This, is, this can be a long tutorial uh, because there's just a lot to do. So, let's get right into it first thing that we need to do is open finder and locate the mod that we downloaded. I'll supply some links to pl good places to download mods in the sidebar. So I'm, I'm going to demonstrate on this Ajax tag board 4 uh, which is what I'm going to use where you see install.xml right click and open with um, a web browser. Alright so, these are the files that we need to edit, and these are the included files, just giving us an um, overview of what's going on. So, let's get right into it. So, the first thing that we need to do is to go to our web host and the online file generator, online file manager, whatever that's there, and basically just go to your root folder. Not the root of your forums because the files are, will be going different places. Then select upload. We're uploading a zip file. If you don't know how to compress um, the tag board, all you need to do is right click and choose compress. Um, on Mac OS X at least. I don't know about Windows users. And then we'll click upload. Alright, it's finished. We'll click submit and we don't want to upload anymore so we'll click back all right now it's there once we've done that we can move on to the copying the next thing we need to do is the file copies so i'm just going to do one because as you can see there are quite a quite a lot um, you'll have to do all of them but i'm only going to demonstrate one all right so what it's telling us is we need to copy this file that is in the folder we just uploaded to this location. Uh, since th this location is not inside any other folders, we assume it, has, it is at the root of our forum. So, let's go back to our file manager, uh, right here, right here, and find that file. As you can see, it's the root directory, and that's what they said, root slash tagboard.php. All right, so it's right here. We're going to click copy. And it's just going to tell us, now we can select where we want to copy it to. So where we're copying it to is, um, let's see forums or whatever you named your forum so you go to your your URL forward slash whatever you type in there is the root of your forum so it's wherever all your forum files are located so in our case it's forums then we'll put another slash we click check and now we can go make sure it's there Go to forums, tagboard.php. Now it's there. So as you can see, um, it's pretty easy stuff. Copy, paste, copy, paste, copy, paste, copy, paste. If you need any help with that, um, message me back. Just make sure you do all 25 of them. Once we have all of the copies done, we can go ahead and do the edits. These are pretty self-explanatory. But even so, I'll run you through one of them. Yeah. All right. So it's telling us to open forward slash open includes slash functions dot php. So I'm in the root folder of my forums, not of the Ajax or the mod folder, the actual forums folder. All right. So it's includes forward slash functions dot php. Alright, so that's right there. I'm going to click edit. 
Okay. And then it's giving us a find. So what I'm going to do there is I'm going to copy it. Come over here, press Command F, and paste that in. Um, okay, and I found it. So it's right there. And then it's telling us add these lines on a new Blake line after the preceding lines to find. So we're just going to add basically this right after. So copy. And then I'll save. And you would do that for all of the edits. All right, guys. There's one thing that you really need to listen to very carefully before proceeding. I'm going to try to explain this as easily as I can to make it easy for you to understand. This tag board is assuming you're using ProSilver. It also gives you instructions on how to install it uh, for SubSilver, which is located in the same um, folder. It's called SubSilver.xml. Open that with Safari. It'll explain it for you. But if you're just following these instructions, you can see that just about all of the copies, um, starting at number 7, are related to styles, images, things like that. If you are using Subsilver, all you got to do is replace Subsilver in the two, replace I mean replace ProSilver with Subsilver two, and you're good to go. Um, with the edits, they may be a little bit trickier because you won't be finding the same thing. You'll be adding the same thing, um, but it won't necessarily be the same thing. So if you're using Subsilver two, go ahead. Um, I'll go ahead and show you. Open up this Subsilver two XML file that comes in the downloaded folder and it'll take you through the basic steps. If you are, however, using a custom a custom board, if it's based on ProSilver, um, basically this is for people who followed my advanced customization tutorial, tweaked to the CSS, things like that, then you need to, if, if it's based on ProSilver, replace ProSilver with the name of your style, the name that is it's referred to by um, PHPBB. So in my case, it'd be Subsilver 2. If it's based on Subsilver 2, then you need to go to the Subsilver 2 instructions located here, open with Safari, do what it tells you here, replace Subsilver 2 with the name of your theme. Guys, I hope that's not too hard to understand, but it, it's major. You can't skip this. You have to do it for the theme you are using. Got it? Cool. Once you've finished uh, doing the edits, there's these basic do-it-yourself instructions. You basically just go to your site slash form root, which uh, uh, for me is forums slash tb underscore install.php. Once you do that, you simply click um, install or go or next, something like that, and you'll get a page that looks like this. Successfully, um, should be success, but you know, whatever. Um, and it's asking us to please delete tb install.php. So I'll go ahead and do that right now. That is located in our forums root, right here. Delete. All right. Now I'll go to my forms, and I have a nice little tag board right here. So hope that helped, guys. Um, thanks for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.